I always enjoyed playing at the Olympic Games, always enjoyed representing my country in both Davis Cup and Olympic Games. Obviously, I don't get to have too many opportunities to play Olympic Games as they happen every four years for, for every athlete. It is one of the dreams, of course. I don't want to be ungrateful for winning bronze because that was also a big success. I played uh, semis in, in, in London and lost, lost there to, for third place as well. But I, as I said, always find an extra motivation to perform at my best when I'm representing the country and especially at the Olympic Games, it's, it's, as we all know, it's, it's the most historical sports event. Having a, an opportunity to be surrounded with uh, elite athletes from their sports, get a chance to see them compete at the highest sporting events is uh, an honor, it's a privilege. And uh, hopefully I can draw strength from there as well and I can be in good shape, good form and, and uh, have a chance to fight for a medal. It's a very unique experience. I'm, I'm enjoying it very much and I have stayed also during Beijing Olympic Games and Rio. Um, I, was, uh, I was staying in the, in the village. Kind of uh, interact with athletes, you know, dine with them. They have questions for me, I have questions for them. We want to exchange the experience share our our journeys our life stories our careers and and you know kind of try to pick their brain and, and understand what they go through you know so maybe something that i can actually use in my own in my own path in my own career but it, as well just admire athletes you know and seeing them practice and seeing them perform you know that's why that's the uniqueness of the olympic games and only olympic games can actually offer something like that tokyo is uh, you know, one of the, the most modern cities I've seen. Very big, very large, multicultural as well, very international. So I'm sure that Olympic Games are going to be a great success there. And I'm sure that uh, considering the technological uh, advancements that they have created actually there in Japan, that is going to be an amazing, uh, amazing show.